we're back for the start of round two. And it took me a second to realize that we actually had three lands in our hands just because uh, they're all tap lands. So we're going to keep this. I would like, I like, see, here's here's where I like drawing Seek the Horizon. We got three lands in hand and Seek the Horizon. And it looks like what the, this could be Mardu, Asband, or Sultai. We know that right off the bat, basically. Hey, I'm, I'm Seek the Horizon. I'm Seeking the Horizon. God, I'm a dork. At this point, I actually hope my computer crashes so nobody actually sees that. Did this guy keep a one lander? What's he doing? It's his upkeep. Does he realize that? I mean, is he waiting for some masterful plan? Oh, maybe he just, like, hit F6 and had to go to the bathroom? Oh, hey, welcome back. Okay, so we're looking at either Asban or Sultai here. Probably Asban, just from what, just from what was circling the table. Yeah. From what was circling the table, that's pretty easy to tell. Sultai was wide open that whole draft. So he wants to swing for two here, rather than outlasting again? Okay, you know what? Anything that is not a, uh... Second turn kin tree, or third turn kin tree spirit, or whatever it is for five, is fine with me. Got black here, we got green here, let's drop a Rakasa. Ra Rakshasa. Rakshasa. Rakshasa the Wombasa. Ha <laughs> ha! Anyway. Rakshasa. Oh, goodbye, Rakshasa. I will miss you. So hopefully we can draw a non-tap land and then seek. Uh, I'm not sure if that's what we want to do. Well, there's our non-tap land, but I think we're actually going to play this and then drop a morph. Especially because next turn, that actually opens us up for uh, Butcher, I think. I'm not really sure about our mana. Black, we got... Oh, we're missing... No, we have the white. Black, white, and red. Hey, we're going for a fifth turn Butcher here. Start pumping that uh, long shot squad, buddy. I'm, all right, this is this is one of those silly plays. All right, so here's what we're gonna do: we are going to swing, and we got five mana open, and we know that our morph can't kill his long shot squad. But at the same time, we're not gonna be blocking, so we are going to bluff our opponent by swinging into him, and then raiding into War Shrieker and then Butcher. So this is actually a pretty tech play, and because I'm fairly positive he's not going to block, unless he wants to set... Yeah, there it is. So what we just did was we just bluffed either a morph, or we bluffed a... Uh, or we bluffed a trick. He didn't want to sacrifice his long shot squad. Not that I blame him. Um, yeah. And I was about to say, if he doesn't outlast here, then he's a fool. I'm going to swing with both the morph and the butcher. 
tempted to swing with everything, actually. But I'm going to leave the Shrieker back to block. Oh, wow, that was foolish. That was really dumb. Why did you guys let me do that? Oh, now i got to slow down with the drinking. That was dumb, dumb, dumb. That was really dumb. All right, chill out for a second, just because you got Butcher on the board for the first time ever in cons. Oh, son of a bitch! Ugh. gonna play uh, Sage because for the next I, I think I'm playing Seek the Horizon next turn oh but it um, doesn't look like I'll be swinging anyway what the hell is this let's just throw everything in front of it maybe this is the booze talking but I just don't care. I don't care if he kills my flyer because I can't get through his long shot squad anyway. Oh, if this locks it on, I'm an idiot. I didn't realize he had six. Oh, it is. Ha! Huh, he's the idiot. He ordered him wrong. Alright, I'll do that trade. Every damn day. We are going to seek at this point. I'm sick of not hit, not dropping lands. And also, I want I want a thinner deck. Uh, what do we? That was the white. Let's get a black. Let's get a green. Um, maybe I should have gotten a red there. But it's all right. Four, five, six. Can't delve into a treasure cruise. But now I'm, I, I actually I think just after how it, how I just played it, I think Seek the Horizon mm -hmm. is an underrated card. I think that was extremely helpful. It sets us, sets us up for uh, land drops. It thins our deck. I like how we've stabilized. Um, a little bit worried about his long shot squad, but not really. I'm actually going to start with Keru next turn. God, this is so awesome. I just tell you, this is a fun deck. Like I, I mean, I mentioned it earlier. I'm I'm probably going to start forcing this. This is a lot of fun. So Keru during our upkeep he is most certainly going to be going for Butcher that we're going to throw at our opponent. Flying Trample in Haste, huh? Okay. But that Blood Flies, that's a problem. Yeah, so what? It's a 3-3. Three, three. Sure. Oh, it's at random. Son of a gun. Oh, poop. And I used my red, so I can't... Oh, that's so foolish. That is worse than I thought it was. Oh... Oh well. That long shot squad is really a problem, actually. Two, three, four, five, six. You know what? Uh, screw the butcher. I'm just gonna. Ah, uh, no. Oh, I thought <sighs> I screwed that up. I really did. I thought I'd be able to choose it. <laughs> I 
and I'm one short of treasure cruising and leaving the butcher there. I screwed that up big time, didn't I? And now he's going to get a... Another creature dies, or... Uh... Okay, so that did not put a counter on Swarm. Okay, that's actually not the end of the world. But I am an idiot for not playing Lox... Oh god, I'm making so many punts th this game. I should have played Loxodon. Sure, I'll trade that for a War Shrieker. Oh, that's why you wanted to do that. That was smart of you. Okay, stop messing up. All right. I think the time has come to villain his wealth our opponent and pray. Nope, not yet. So let's cruise first. Got a lot of green. <clears throat> let's play secret plans. And then let's drop a blocker. So we're going to drop blood fire mentor. Got a lot of stuff going on here, but I'll tell you, this is not good. Been making a lot of mistakes. So I guess we take ten. Once again, Villainous Wealth is going to be our answer here, huh? Hopefully it's our answer. Some serious business going on on, this, on the other side of the board, I'll tell you. Alright, we're going to Villainous Wealth for seven. Cast a lot of spells here. So let's injure this guy. And we get to play four creatures. Cast, 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 cast. Okay. Uh who did I injure? Okay, good. I injured this blood flies. Smart, smart, smart. So we got five spells out of seven. That was pretty that was pretty good. That was not good. <laughs> oh man, who did he just kill? Oh, he just killed his own scavenger. Now we have very... I'm actually expecting... You know, obviously I'm expecting to lose at this point. Uh, we have very little removal. Um, we needed to block there. I don't think we have any removal. Oh, murderous cut. Or uh, sorry, Sultai charm. Nope, not gonna do it. So before we show him any more cards, oh, actually we can m drop and then unmorph maybe. So we want to leave. Th it's black, green, blue. Oh, we're going to be one short. We're gonna, oh, God. It's just they just dropped the tap land. Are you serious? Mm. 
Yeah, it's because I just dropped the tap land. Okay, so if I if I draw a the Sultai charm here, then I am a moron. I just I have to do it just to see if if that would have been the answer. No, we would have lost anyway. All right. Well, hopefully game two will go better. I mean, we made a lot of mistakes. That's the only way to put that. He's got the flyer. Um, he knows that we want to go lawn game. I think we were going to bring in Death Frenzy? Are we? Maybe not. I don't know. I'm tempted to bring in the second Sultai charm. Mm. Ah, screw it. Let's just go. I want to point out that if we had a game, game, uh, sorry, turn one alter, we would have won due to decking. Uh, just, just saying, you know. Just one of those things. I'm just saying. Ah, oh, we're on the play of two lands. I don't think we can mull against this opponent, so we're just gonna keep it and pray, see what happens. Wait, and I've been drinking a little bit. Not the, not the opening hand I wanted. Let's just put it that way, and that, that's being polite about it. Getting better because this turns us into a turn three bloodfire mentor if we need it. A lot of bloodstained Myers going around this pod, huh? We got the foil one. We had this one. Let's put me right here. That's where I'm going. Okay, and he didn't have a two drop. So that opens us up to Ponyback. It's actually working out rather well. If we draw a white source, then we can uh fourth turn Bloodfire Mentor, fifth turn Unmorph. Yeah, your morph is dead to debilitating injury. There's our white source. Holy smokes. This is going well for us. Oh, this guy has a ruin all kinds of fun, doesn't he? Forgot about our aerialist as a as a flying answer. So I mean, if he blocks, he's gonna get the crap kicked out of him like you wouldn't believe. But he doesn't. Not that I blame him. Um, let's drop aerialist here. Murderous cut in my aerialist. Okay. Gotta be honest, I didn't see that coming. That hurt, but I would have. Yeah, that 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 stung a little. Not gonna lie. I think he held it back for a reason. So let's see what happens here. He doesn't have the three mana for kill shot. Okay. Just take two to the face, I guess. And I'm happy with our position here. As band guide. Or not? Yep. Huh. 
Swing with the locks. And I'm actually going to cast Brood and then leave the mana open to unmorph Stalker. I don't think he'll be stupid enough to attack without a trick. Which he obviously has. That's annoying. Let's just see what it is. Yep. We are lagging just a little bit, so I gotta be careful with my clicking. <sighs> I, we're, we're gonna turn it up here just to accurate to be able to use our mana next turn. Disappointing right there, man. That's all that was. I was doing really well until the uh, Rakasha's Secret screwed me up. That's bad, too. Holy shoot. Yeah, it's probably game. Wow. And a thunder is beating by our opponent. That's what we just received. A thunder is beating. Like, just... Ah! That was... And I'm pretty sure it's because of the Rakasha secret. Oh well. Fun deck though, so I'll, I'll see you back for round three.